The James Webb Telescope has uncovered the clearest image of Proxima b in history, revealing staggering information about a potentially habitable exoplanet. It compels us to embark on a journey through space to uncover the secrets of Proxima b and determine if it could be the next Earth. Let's take off into the vast expanse of space, where a mysterious planet exists in the habitable zone of its star Proxima Centauri. This planet isn't just any ordinary rock, it's Proxima b, located a mere 4.2 light-years from us. Shrouded in mysteries and wonders, could it be another Earth, with oceans and life flourishing on its surface? But wait there's more. Proxima Centauri b isn't alone in its orbit around the red dwarf star. It has a companion, Proxima Centauri c, and who knows what other secrets this star system holds. Perhaps there's another undiscovered celestial body yet to be found. The mystery doesn't stop there. Proxima Centauri emits a similar amount of energy to Earth's Sunday. Could this mean there's water on Proxima b's surface, and maybe even life? As we explore beyond our solar system, we encounter a vast universe of exoplanets planets that orbit stars other than the Sun. With around 200 billion stars in the Milky Way, the opportunities for exoplanets are endless. Some exoplanets even wander freely, untethered to any star like nomads in space. Among them, Proxima Centauri b stands out as an especially striking and captivating planet. Its year lasts only 112 Earth days, and its distance from its star is much closer than Earth's distance from the Sun. One side of the planet is perpetually bathed in sunlight, while the other remains in eternal darkness. Now let's examine Proxima Centauri, the star that Proxima b orbits. Proxima Centauri is part of the Alpha Centauri triple star system, which includes Rigel Centaurus, also known as Alpha Centauri A, and Alpha Centauri B. Together, these stars form the closest star system to our solar system. The two stars, Rigel Centaurus and Alpha Centauri B, make up a binary system known as Alpha Centauri A and B. These G and K-type stars appear as one star in the Centaurus constellation and are the third brightest stars in our night sky, with a peak luminosity of less than 2.7. Proxima Centauri, also called Alpha Centauri C, is a red dwarf or M-type star, located 4.2 light-years from us. It is the closest star to Earth besides the Sun. In fact, Proxima means the closest in Latin. It was discovered in 1915 by Scottish astronomer Robert Innes. Despite being our nearest celestial neighbor, it isn't visible to the naked eye, with an apparent magnitude of 11.13, far dimmer than the human eye's visibility limit of 6.5. However, don't let that fool you. Proxima Centauri is still a fascinating star worth studying. Red dwarfs like Proxima Centauri are among the most efficient in terms of energy production. While they don't generate much energy, their internal convection processes allow them to shine for trillions of years. Proxima Centauri is expected to remain a main sequence star for another 4 trillion years. But the habitability of a red dwarf star like Proxima Centauri is still debated. For one, it is a flare star meaning it experiences frequent and intense bursts of radiation. As a low-mass star, its habitable zone would be much closer to it than the Sun's habitable zone, estimated to be between 0.023 and 0.054 Australian dollars. However, it's not as habitable as it might seem. Proxima b is bombarded by intense ultraviolet radiation from its star, far stronger than the radiation Earth receives from the Sun. The radiation is so extreme that even the lightest elements, such as hydrogen, are stripped away, along with nitrogen and oxygen. But that's not all. Just because a planet is at the right distance from its star doesn't mean it can support life. Proxima b may lack a stable atmosphere, which is essential for regulating temperature and maintaining a water-friendly surface. Without an atmosphere, living organisms would be vulnerable to harsh space conditions, making life nearly impossible. So, while Proxima b may seem Earth-like on the surface, it is far from being able to support life. Scientists remain cautious, as there are many factors that make the planet inhospitable. The mission to uncover the truth about Proxima b continues. Some still hold hope. One tool that has captured astronomers' attention is the James Webb Telescope. After years of anticipation, 
The telescope was finally launched in 2018, and it will help determine whether life exists on Proxima b. However, as with all things in science, the reality is never as straightforward as it seems. Some modifications were needed to ensure the James Webb Telescope delivers accurate images. As Abby Tabor, a theoretical physicist at Harvard, explains, if a planet like Proxima b can absorb light from its star, it can also emit it as infrared light. The James Webb Telescope was specifically designed to detect infrared light, allowing it to capture images of this light from the planet's surface and search for patterns that might confirm the presence of water or an atmosphere. But what if the planet has an atmosphere that isn't conducive to life? The presence of an atmosphere doesn't guarantee the presence of life, warns Ed Turner, an astrophysicist at Princeton University. Proxima b could be more like Venus, with a thick, dense atmosphere and extreme temperatures that make life impossible. The journey to unravel the mysteries of Proxima b isn't without its challenges. While the James Webb Telescope holds promise, there are many other factors to consider. With mounting costs, space scientists are feeling the pressure to find effective ways to observe planets like Proxima b. The stakes are high, but the potential rewards are even greater. The opportunity to explore the unknown, to uncover the secrets of a distant planet that may hold the potential for life, is a pursuit worth chasing. If Proxima b were habitable, could we one day visit it? It is, after all, the closest exoplanet to us, making it a fascinating subject for study. Even more exciting is that it is roughly the same size as Earth, and its position in the habitable zone suggests it could indeed have conditions suitable for life. Proxima b's proximity makes it an ideal target in our search for life beyond Earth. With it being so close, it is a prime candidate for interstellar missions. Imagine exploring this Earth-like exoplanet. Although we can't go there yet, it's certainly on the radar for future missions. As technology advances, it remains one of the most thrilling prospects in space exploration. However, it's no easy task. It would take 75,000 years to get there using current technology. Years for a rocket like Explorer 2 to arrive at the Proxima Centauri system would be immense. However, an answer has been proposed. Solar sails. These ultra-thin sails could be used to propel a spacecraft to the Alpha Centauri system, and Proxima alongside it. This technology uses solar pressure to keep the shuttle on course, eliminating the problem of running out of fuel. And here's something even cooler. This state-of-the-art technology could provide insights into the possibility of life on other planets, like Proxima b. However, like any ambitious endeavor, there are limitations. For example, the presence of an atmosphere doesn't necessarily guarantee the presence of life. Proxima b could be similar to Venus, with a thick, hot atmosphere that is inhospitable. Besides, get this, the James Webb Telescope can detect such emissions if they reach a brightness of just 5% of the daytime side. Now, 5% may not seem like much, but when dealing with a star that is generally dimmer than our own sun, it's quite significant. If Proxima b harbors advanced civilizations, they might use bright orbital mirrors to reflect sunlight from the daytime side to the nighttime side. How cool is that? There are countless exoplanets waiting to be discovered in our universe. These planets come in all shapes and sizes. Some are massive gas giants, while others resemble our own Earth. But what do we know about them? One type of exoplanet that has captured the attention of space scientists is the gas giant. These planets are similar in structure to Jupiter and Saturn but are much larger. Some of these behemoths have been dubbed super-Jupiters, surpassing even the largest planet in our solar system. But that's not all. There are also hot Jupiters, gas giants that orbit extremely close to their host star, existing in a scorching world with temperatures high enough to melt metal. Imagine seeing such a planet up close, with its raging storms and extreme heat. In addition to gas giants, there are also Neptunian exoplanets, which are similar in size to Uranus and Neptune. Among these are hot Neptunes and mini-Neptunes, which are smaller and closer to their host stars than their gas giant cousins. These planets are often shrouded in mystery, with their atmospheres being difficult to study from a distance. And let's not forget the Earth-like exoplanets, which resemble our own planet. These planets come in various sizes, ranging from smaller than Earth to twice its size. 
There are even super-Earths, which have masses more than twice that of our planet but are still lighter than Neptune. One of the most fascinating exoplanets discovered recently is Proxima Centauri b, which orbits the star of the same name. This planet is classified as a super-Earth, with an estimated mass of seven Earth masses. Although it is close to its host star, it is still too far away to be considered within the habitable zone. Proxima Centauri b isn't alone, it has a companion, Proxima Centauri c, which is much farther from the star. This planet has an orbital period of about five Earth years and was discovered in 2020 using pre-recovery Hubble data. Even more interestingly, Proxima Centauri c appears to be an incredibly bright world, possibly due to the presence of a ring system. There's even more to uncover in the Proxima Centauri system. In 2019, astronomers detected a shift in the star's orbital speed, which could indicate the presence of another planetary companion. If confirmed, this planet will be called Proxima Centauri d and will be roughly the size of Mercury or Mars. Imagine a reality where the night sky isn't just filled with stars but also countless other planets, each with its own unique characteristics and orbits. The universe is full of surprises, and exoplanets are just one of them. With new discoveries being made constantly, it's an exciting time to be a space scientist. While we don't yet have an exact count of exoplanets, we do know they exist, just as we know the stars that illuminate the universe. However, exoplanets present challenges. They are often hidden by the brightness of their host stars, making them difficult to study. Still, with advancements in technology, direct imaging of exoplanets is now possible. For an exoplanet to be directly imaged, it must be large enough to be seen by a telescope, far enough from its host star to avoid being obscured, and young enough to be hot and visible from Earth. These requirements limit the number of exoplanets that can be directly imaged, but they provide a fascinating glimpse into the characteristics and composition of these distant worlds. Exoplanets are most commonly discovered through the changes they cause in their host stars. The gravitational pull of an exoplanet can cause its host star to wobble, and this radial velocity can be detected by astronomers. The Kepler Space Telescope used the transit method, which measures the dimming of a star's light when an exoplanet passes in front of it. This method has provided valuable data about exoplanets, including their size, distance, and temperature. Here are a couple of fun facts. Did you know that more than 22% of sun-like stars have Earth-sized planets in their habitable zones? Or that Trappist, one is home to seven rocky exoplanets with water on their surfaces. Exoplanets, like those in our solar system, can also have natural satellites known as exomoons. With over 4,000 exoplanets discovered so far, we know they exist in abundance throughout the universe. Hot Jupiters, with their massive size and rapid rotation, are the easiest to detect, yet countless other exoplanets remain undiscovered. NASA's James Webb Space Telescope is unveiling the secrets of the universe, one discovery at a time. This extraordinary telescope has been gathering data and capturing breathtaking images of the cosmos, revealing previously unknown wonders. Recently, it made a groundbreaking discovery that will forever change our understanding of the universe. NASA announced that the James Webb Space Telescope has found the first definitive evidence of carbon dioxide in the atmosphere of a planet outside our solar system. This discovery provides crucial insights into the planet's composition and formation, giving us a glimpse into the mysteries of the universe. This gas giant planet orbits a sun-like star 700 light-years away, and this finding marks a significant step forward in the search for extraterrestrial life. NASA Administrator Bill Nelson stated that this discovery would give us a new perspective on the universe, one we've never seen before, sparking excitement among astronomers and scientists worldwide. But that's not all. The James Webb Space Telescope has been busy capturing stunning images and gathering infrared data. The light from the young glowing object known as 110 Iris illuminates the cool, wispy cloud material, while the orange spots behind the cloud reveal light from distant stars obscured by ice. This remarkable observation was part of Webb's Ice Age project, which aims to study the formation of ice from its creation to the development of icy comets. And that's not all. The James Webb Space Telescope has imaged the inner workings of a dusty disk surrounding a nearby red dwarf star, 
capturing it for the first time at these light frequencies in the infrared.